Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with Elden Gunfire 2, which is a new game. It's on Steam and full disclosure, I did receive my copy of the game for free. So let's play. Hold up. All right, so we've got a little uh, army dude, I guess. We can change what he looks like. But it's, it's all dudes, I guess. Oh, uh, we and, and we have to we have to pay to unlock them, right? So we can't. So we're just we're just Captain Standard military dude there. All right. Uh, I mean, all right. I guess I guess that's the only one we can do. All right, let's go find game and let's play some Elden Gunfire Two. Right. There's our ping, 83 ping, that's not bad. Oh, here we go. So we're gonna play. So there are other people playing this? I, I don't, those do look like the names of people because they're, they're just, they're random. Right. Okay, so that guy's got a knife. He's trying to stab people. How do you... Right. I mean, we're, we're, doing a, we're doing pretty well. Okay. Old dude's got some guns. Or got some knives. Yeah, got that one. There we go. All right. I mean, we're we're just kind of hosing them. Oh, I got killed. Okay. I got killed. Is there is there Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm doing well, but I did get killed. Haha, ha, you tried to get me, but I got you instead. I'm the best. Oh, there's a guy running around behind me. Trying to, trying to shoot at me, huh, buddy? Ah, uh, yeah, there was a bomb there. I saw the bomb and I was trying to get away, but I couldn't. I'm still doing well. Considering it's my first match ever. I mean, it's uh, it's pretty colorful, you know? I mean, are, are we sure these guys aren't bots? They, they're definitely starting to, they sort of feel like bots. Normally in a game like this that has like established players, if uh, if I came in, oop. yeah, there we go. If I came in like this, I would normally just get absolutely blasted. But uh, I mean, I'm not. Oop. Guy with the knife just uh, seems to do nothing. Okay, what are we what are we up to? All right, so so I'm in the lead now. Oh, I got killed by Tommy again. So those all look like real names, but there's three Tommies. So they are bots. So we're playing against bots, so the, the Tommies are, are just bots. Right, so that's that's why I'm that's why I'm winning is because we're playing against a bunch of bots. Right. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna get exploded. 
Right. So, was that friendly fire? I mean, is there friendly fire? I actually don't know. Okay. I mean... It's okay. There's nothing particularly wrong with it. Uh, you know what? I'm going to fast forward um, and see if we can get to a different map. Oh, I'm out of bullets. So what happens now? I just... Um, so I don't have an... I don't have any other weapons or anything, so I guess we're just... I mean... There we go. Uh, I, I need him to kill me so I can get more bullets. It's pretty dumb. Yeah, but I'll fast forward to see what, if we get some more content. So I can't tell if these guys are just bots and I'm just playing against uh, weirdly named bots and that, that would make sense I guess um, or if everyone else is just bad at this game but me. My guess is it's bots because I've never been this good at really any game, certainly not multiplayer games, certainly not when I've just first started playing them. Um, I just don't, I don't see how... Um, oop. I don't see how this could be me being good and not just, uh, the fact that I'm playing against non-humans. Because they're, they're making decisions that I, I, don't, I don't really get. But that's okay. I don't like these medics. I mean, is he just, is he just regenerating health? That's what's, is that what's going on? We'll just go fight someone else. Yeah, see that guy's just gonna stand there and that's good. This medic is just chasing me around, but he's not he's not like able to kill me? What is going on here? Yeah, I don't I don't I don't really understand. So we're out of we're out of ammo anyway. And I haven't figured out the secret to picking up new ammo, so we'll just let them kill us. Um Yeah. So maybe there's one other, maybe there's one player on the other team? I don't, I don't know, man. It could be the other person that's got like 28 points or whatever. I don't, hard to say, man, hard to say. Yep. Stupid medic. It's like impossible to kill. I've definitely pumped a lot of rounds into him. It does nothing. Does he, does he have cheats or something on? I don't. I don't know, man. I'm just. Gonna, I'm gonna stop using ammo on him because there's no point. Um. Yeah. So yeah. So I am getting this feeling that this game is populated by bots. Yeah, and the the names are just generated randomly because there's no way that I could be this good at this game having just started and other people could be this bad it's just not it's just not possible it's a stupid medic again that doesn't take damage there's like no point in fighting him ugh like no matter how many times I hit the medic he doesn't take any damage so there's no point that is uh, that is incredibly frustrating but I mean it would only be it would be super frustrating if um, the rest of the gameplay made sense but it doesn't really 
I mean, it does. It, it does make sense, except for that, um, obviously no one else is actually playing. Because, uh, none of the actual, um, sort of... I mean, the, the most damning indictment of, uh, this being bots is that I'm winning. Is that I'm the number one player in the server. Yeah? There's no way that bot- that- that real players could be that bad. I'm just saying. So that medic is just, uh, invincible. So... I mean, like, we can't- we can't do anything to him. So that's me, like, shooting him. Yeah, it does nothing. Okay. Right, so someone's cheating in this game. Lepib is cheating. Or the game is just broken. My guess is the game is broken. Um, yeah. I mean, they're obviously playing a class or something, because there's obviously some classes. Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't see any baddies. Or all the fighting's over here. Is that that's just the that's just the stupid. Oh. There we go. But, uh, it's this medic that doesn't take damage. There's, there's no reason for me to go fight you, buddy. Like, not even a little bit. But I am just looking for some more dudes to fight. Okay, here we go. It's a stupid medic. Okay, that's everybody but the medic. Right. Yeah, well, I'm obviously the best at this game. I'm number one, El Numero Uno. The number one ranked player in the entire planet. Um, Single-handedly carrying the team despite there being a blatant hacker. Um, yeah. Gotcha. I love the shotgun. Right. Who else is who else is here? Yeah, gotcha. I mean that's not the uh As long as it's not the medic, we're fine. That being said, uh I'm having to outpace two of their players to keep us in the lead, which I can do because they're bots. They're very well named bots, so that they they look like real players. Because bots, you know, they usually have like a a dumb. You know, oh, we won! There we go. Right, we got a level out of it as well. We got 70 coins. Love it. What does the replay do? I don't know what replay does. Is it gonna show us the actual gameplay again? Ah, uh, no, I don't want. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. All right, let's um, let's go look at the description and see what the game has to say for itself. Elden Gunfire 2, a comic, funny, and cute online multiplayer third-person shooter game for everyone with fantastic cartoon 3D next-generation graphics and captivating gameplay. Uh, developed by Amonga99, and it currently has very positive reviews. Came out on the 20th of July. Um, we need the community to play our game and give us feedbacks. Give us the feedbacks so we can make what they want from the game while we're still developing it. And as our game is multiplayer, we need to build, player, build a player's database as early as possible so players can easily find others to play with. We intend to have the game in early access for 12 to 16 months. Um, so the... the Full version will have 10 maps, 40 characters, 100 weapons, 20 grenades, 10 perks, oh, 10 perks, sorry. More game FX downs, effects and musics. Um, there's four playable maps, 40 characters, 100 weapons, 20 grenades, and 10 perks. Uh, we plan to gradually raise the price as we ship new content and features. We are always present on Steam, forums, and game forums, and answer things. Right. So, the Undisputables are back with a new, strong title, Elden Gunfire 2, which brings a completely new multiplayer cartoon shooter experience. A comic, funny, and cute online multiplayer third-person shooter for you. With new, remastered, and detailed, fantastic, stylized cartoon 3D graphics and captivating gameplay. 
The maps, models, details, shaders, materials, controls, music, and full game UI are completely remade to bring a new next generation looking game with normal maps, modern lighting, and post processing while keeping the cartoon looking style. Choose your unique character and weapons from tons of different characters and weapons of different classes and styles. Assault, SMG, sniper, shotgun, knife, pistol, grenade, LMG, heavy machine guns, grenade launcher, laser pistol, water gun, electric gun, lava gun, flamethrower. Each one with special properties. Customize your own and unique fighting skills and jump into the action. Enter the battle and engage in team online PvP combat against other players around the world on a variety of maps. Play with, against, with or against your friends in both online or local team deathmatch. The controls are intuitive and super easy to master with sweet interface. With sweet interface. Okay. Uh, regular content updates including new characters, weapons, bombs, skills, and maps, stunning graphics, cute sound effects, epic war SFX, and beautiful musics. Create a fun comic cartoon atmosphere. Let's look at the uh, reviews here. There are a lot of problems. The animation is in poor condition. Everything is bad. Um... With 1,200 plus reviews, make sure to follow the Captain Froggy Club Curator page for plenty more. Oof. That is a long review, my dude. Um, need, need to reduce the cost of upgrades. A total buggy mess. Elden Ring, no. Elden Gunfire, too. Game looks cool and has great potential. Looking forward to new features. Um, just when you've had enough of popular shooters and need a reboot in your gamer experience. Okay. Um... Excellent multiplayer shooter in cartoon style. So they've got one review. A lot of these have uh, a f very few reviews. I'm always a little bit wary of uh, games that have like one review or four reviews on their account because generally speaking, unless the game is like bananas good and people go, oh man, I, uh, this, I don't usually review games, but this is the first time I've done a review. Um, you don't usually see people with like five reviews reviewing a game. Um, yeah, no weapon drops for killed opponents to replace my empty gun. I can only exit the game with Alt F4. Let's see what the developer had to say about that. To quit the game in match, click Escape button to show cursor, then click Settings and Quit to go to Main Menu, then Setting Quit to quit the game. Right. Um, want to enjoy this as it has the potential to be fun, but there are too many issues at the point of review. Reloading animations are very bad and inconsistent. Hit reg on players can be massive miss, and the controls are vile. I'm going to leave this game for a bit, come back in about a year, and see how it looks. Just don't. Um, yeah. Let's see what the developer had to say about the uh, the controls and stuff. I'm always interested to see how the developer res responds. Reload animation. The sound does not match. I will fix it. Controls. What does not work for you? Reg hit. Can you explain more? Thank you. Right. So you know they're responding positively to the uh, feedback. I'm pretty certain that the um, that the people I was playing against were bots. I, like, there's no way that I'm the best at Elden Gunfire 2 in the entire world, um, unless most of the people playing are bots. Yeah, there might have been one or two other real people, but it definitely felt like bots to me. So, let's look at Among uh, 99. So they've got uh, Elden Gunfire 2, so there's a demo, so you can download the demo and play it yourself uh, if you want to try it out. They've got Fire on Fight and the Undisputables. Right, let's, uh, let's, let's have a look. So in August of 2021, they released the, oh sorry, December 2021, they released a game called The Undisputables. Let's have a look. So that had 11 reviews, right? And it's it's the exact same game. There, there appear to be no updates. In fact, the uh, this has more maps than the other one, right? All right. So that's so the the game we're playing, the Elden Gunfire, uh, Elden Gunfire Two, is a sequel to the Undisputables. That's what it said, right? So then in March, they released a game called Fire on Fight, online multiplayer. Right, and this has realistic graphics rather than cartoon graphics. Okay. Um, is a competitive online multiplayer first-person shooter game with stunning 3D graphics and captivating gameplay. Right, but it's an early access as well. You know, it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't be a game without uh, talking about graphics and talking about early access. Got to have that early access, boy. Got to get in there. All right, so Fire on Fight, The Undisputables, and then... 
So they made a demo in August 2021. Three months later, they make uh, they release the game. Then in February, they release a demo for Fire on Fight, which is a uh, not cartoony first person or third person shooter, or it's a first person shooter, whatever. And then in March they release it, and then in July they release Elden Fire, uh, Elden Gunfire Two. Right. So that's a that's a fairly uh, meaty release schedule for a developer, a brand new developer. Yeah. Um, look, I don't know what they're doing. I don't know how this is working. Um, I don't get the sensation that uh, that it's ever going to come out of early access because they're just going to keep releasing new games. Because if you're if you're business model is to release a game every three months um you're not gonna and you're telling me here that you plan to be uh in early access for 12 to 16 months what you're telling me is that while you're developing four other games you're also going to be uh developing this game plus the early access for those four other games because presumably they'll be in early access as well so You've got a small studio, and I'm guessing it might be one or two people, maybe three, I don't know. Um, it does say we, so I'm, I'm assuming there might be more than one person. Um, you're saying that, you know, that amount of people are, are enough people to be designing, like, at least four games on the go at all times? Seems not likely. Um, the gameplay here is fine. It's, you know, there's nothing wrong with it. Uh, the the complaints about the controls are probably right. The um, the the reloading animations are, are really bad. Uh, they take forever, and um, it's not really clear what's going on. Um, feedback on when you hit things is not amazing either. Um, there's there was that medic that just couldn't take that took no damage from anything. Yeah, I mean, there's stuff to like here. It is colorful, it's bright, it's a shooter. Um, you know, I'm totally down for, like, a colorful, bright shooter and stuff. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, I was definitely playing against bots, right? Because I'm not the best at this game in the world. Um, which, like I said, leads me to believe that a lot of the positive reviews here, the ones that have two reviews or one review or whatever, are uh, friends of the dev, you know? And that's, that's the likely scenario here. Um, but I'm going to leave it. That's Elden Gunfire 2. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. Um, leave me a comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. That's always really nice. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Class dismissed.